I'm I'm watching. I'm peeping. You in? We got Bayonetta and Richter. Bayonetta and Richter. Oh shit. Three, two, one, oh, it's wild card. Go. I remember wild card. Go. Take this. Toss them things, boy. Oh, she's getting the combo in. I can barely make out the bait that it's name. I think this is Comatose. He's actually Insomniac. He's in New York. Yeah. Okay, New York man. Okay, cool. cool. Got all New Yorkers here. Brawling it out. Interesting matchup I don't see often. Bayonetta and Richter. Usually this means like a... You got a zoner and a... Sort of... Still a semi rushdown type character. Jeez. Heal slides her way in most of the time. Ooh, nice use of the witch time there, but no punish. Dang, nice angle of the uh, forward air right there. That was good coverage from, from the fire. Yeah, uh, so that Bayonetta strat was pretty good, just to hold the guns out there, because it was a little slow in the air. So he has to like, hold that. If he gets tossed in that situation, he's probably gonna air dodge immediately to get out. Ooh, combo setup, here we go. Good read on that uh, landing. The Bayonetta is also opting to use Witch Time for for all the item tosses, so it's good. It's a good way to avoid all of uh, Richter's uh, setups right now, because the setups usually start from the flame. Oh, missed the grab there. A little far. Yeah, using that Witch Time is pretty helpful in this matchup right here. Doesn't matter if you get the counter, just as long as you avoid the item, which is the bad part of getting hit by that. Uh, also using the guns to zone out a bit too, because they go a little further, like, like almost mid range ish Ooh, take him to the sky. Some good damage right there. I like that. Ooh, no death because that wasn't hit. Also, one thing that people don't really talk about for Bayonetta is the fact that they can stall a bit with their uh, extra jump up Bs and their afterburner kicks. It takes a while for it to come back. Ooh, nice up B. That's a killer option right there. Ooh, the pressure on that platform was intense right there. <laughs> it's, it's like, there's nowhere you can go. This Bayonetta is in, in good advantage state right here. Oh, nice heal drop right there, just to take that stock. I'm liking this play. It's pretty good. Small, decent punish from the Richter right there off the platform. Oh, using the turnaround uh, boomerang toss thing. Whenever a character has a boomerang, I always see them do that just for a setup. But that gets to punish. Ooh. Oh no! Slightly misses the ledge and dies. That sucks. I hate to see it. Dreadful, even. Game one going to the Bayonetta. Somniac, pretty good. Even though we're resorting to Wi-Fi times, you know, we still gotta put on a good show here for our players. That was a good match. We did game one right there. Let's see what uh, Wildcard will switch to next, if he plans on switching. Oh, what's good, Durant and Gar? Excuse me. <laughs> Alright, I'm good. Okay, so... Um, hey guys, I was wondering if I could jump in, um, because I noticed a little somebody-somebody playing, and I thought, I, you know, I want to commentate the rest of the set. Alright. Dope. Was it the Richter, or was it the Bayonetta? I saw Insomniac playing, and I'm like, whew, I'm uh -huh. gonna... 
gonna watch this a little bit. Nice. Anyways. Always, always support the homies. All right, so game all time. I saw was the end of game one, right? And I saw that Insomniac won for, with like a two stock lead. Yes, yes. Insomniac applied a really good pressure there. Mm -hmm. And unfortunately, Wildcard missed the ledge in that last stock, but hopefully he can reach his hands out there just to be able to grab it. You know, use that forward air, that tether. Just to try to grab it this time. Right now, it seems like Wildcard is fishing a little bit through these holy, uh, through these holy water setups, and Insomniac is doing a really good job of just like spacing himself like above uh, Wildcard's like sort of range of threat. Yeah. Uh, Insomniac's doing a good job of keeping, uh, themselves, uh, in there. They would, uh, use the afterburner kick just to be right under Richter, just to, just to put that, put the pressure on that character. Be like, alright, I'm under you. <laughs> Insomniac had a really good lead there if he was gonna go for the holy water, um, at that distance, uh, but was unable to actually connect the side beat. Yeah, right there. And that's not going to be it quite yet. Yeah, Belmont's relatively heavy, and you know that move str struggles to kill, but actually unable to make it back onto stage. Yeah, right there. Prime example of uh, being that putting the pressure on the character, just being right under Richter. Like Richter probably has like no choice but to use the dive kick there if he sees mm -hmm. Bayonetta under him. But it's a little slow. So and whiffing it they got him in a bad spot right there. Yep. So like and again, I like. Sorry. Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, no, I'm sorry. I cut you off. <laughs> yeah, no, so I, you uh, I just like wanted to like quickly point out that Insomniac, he jumped in. He knew that uh, Wildcode was going to overcommit to another projectile at mid range, um, and he was like perfectly in range to get hit with the side beat. Wildcode yeah. just needs to maybe like slow this down and try to uh, anti air uh, Insomniac a little bit, or just try to just maybe react and see uh, without pressing the button preemptively. Ooh, that was Whoa. nice. That was sick. I like that combo right there. That little up tilt to up smash at which time. Don't see that like too often. But yeah, uh, Wildcard has to keep uh, his space against the Bayonetta in this matchup, but Bayonetta's doing a really good job of keeping like the right positioning for for her combo game and uh, with punishing. Mm -hmm. Trying to connect from the side, be not able to find it. That's going to be the drag down here into up B. Not going to kill quite yet. You have to be a little bit closer. That move has like a lot, like, it definitely has like a lot of like the base knock back. Um, so oh, it's like uh, up B, uh, Belmont's up B. So oh, yeah. Insomniac was like a little bit closer to the blast zone, um, it could kill like as early as like 4 B. Okay. Using it as a reversal option. I remember in game one, that's how we took this uh, stock. Ooh, nice four, four tilt right there. Tipper yeah. four tilt right there. Yeah, catching Insomniac's neutral air dodge, drifting out. Oh, he tried Ooh, to uh, go for the witch time. That's so harsh. Insomniac having a rough time trying to keep his pain that off. Oh, witch time, that's it. Oh, should have been. Yeah, this is a really good tool. Stop whatever setup while mm -hmm. card has to go to it. You know, for sure. Even like whether or not you get Witch Time or you just get like the bats, um, it'll just immediately sort of stop any sort of uh, ledge trapping from all code. So he has to maybe try to bait that out and try to get a bigger punish off on the uh, off on the lag there. Four air combo. While Code is struggling to land, but Samyak is actually going to retreat a little bit. I don't think he intended uh, for his neutral beat to be reversed like that. Yeah, which time still being the godsend for this character. Oh, dead. Yeah, that's all he had to do. Good stuff to Insomniac right there, taking both games. Yeah, no, very, very clean, confident 2 0. It's also, like I think, really important to note that last week at the uh, DNA uh, online weekly, he took grand finals over uh, Luffy. Uh, who is very, very, you know, spicy uh, Belmont as well. So I feel uh -huh. like Insomniac's very refreshed in the uh, in the matchup as well. Yeah, good on him, good on him. Good stuff. Very knowledgeable yeah. of that matchup right there. Yeah, that's it. I just wanted to comment this one set. <laughs> um, I'll, be back. I'll be back a little bit later tonight to do a little bit of top eight um, and whatnot. But uh, I'll see you guys in a bit. So sorry that I, I'm jumping in and I'm leaving already. But I'll, no, I'll see you guys right. soon, I promise. We'll hold it down.
All right, that was a nice game.